मल्टीपल ऑर्गन डिसफंक्शन सिंड्रोम एम ओ डी एस कॉजेस एंड सिम्टम्स मल्टीपल ऑर्गन डिसफंक्शन सिंड्रोम और एम ओ डी एस इज हर्ड टू और मोर इंडिपेंडेंट ऑर्गन्स फेल टू फंक्शन प्रॉपरली इट इज अ सीरियस कंडीशन डेट कैन लीड टू डेथ विदाउट इमरजेंसी केयर Multiple organ dysfunction syndrome can affect any organ system. For example, someone with multiple organ dysfunction syndrome may experience heart and kidney failure. Treatment for these conditions can become complex. This video will discuss the symptoms of multiple organ dysfunction syndrome, its causes, and how doctors might treat it. What is multiple organ dysfunction syndrome? Multiple organ dysfunction syndrome or multi organ failure refers to the process of multiple organ dysfunction. The severity of this dysfunction for each organ can vary from mild to severe. However, multiple organ failure is always serious and requires emergency care. Many people who experience multiple organ dysfunction syndrome will require long term treatment in a critical care unit the condition has a high risk of death with researchers estimating between 40 to 50% of people with multiple organ dysfunction syndrome will die depending on how many organs fail the condition may start gradually and worsen with time Despite its severity there is a lack of research into the condition and few effective treatments available Symptoms Multiple organ dysfunction syndrome is where multiple organs fail so the symptoms will vary substantially depending on which organs the condition affects The symptoms will also depend on how severely the condition affects each organ. There are six primary organ systems that multiple organ dysfunction syndrome can affect. Respiratory system. The respiratory system includes the lungs and other organs that allow the body to breathe. Multiple organ dysfunction syndrome can involve damage to the respiratory system. that prevents typical breathing it could lead to respiratory failure or the lungs cannot supply enough oxygen to the blood for the body to function urinary system the urinary system filters the blood and creates urine it includes major organs such as the kidneys multiple organ dysfunction syndrome can occur when the urinary system cannot properly filter waste products from the blood doctors call this renal failure which can cause confusion darkened urine and itchy skin cardiovascular system the cardiovascular system transports blood and nutrients around the body to support functioning heart failure is when the heart cannot pump enough blood around the body and can cause shortness of breath swelling around the body and tiredness central nervous system the central nervous system includes the brain spinal cord and nerve and nerves around the body multiple organ dysfunction syndrome can involve brain dysfunction and lead to to a loss of consciousness or confusion Hepa- hepatic system the hepatic system includes the liver and other organs that regulate chemicals in the blood multiple organ dysfunction syndrome can cause liver failure which is where this organ is unable to function properly this can lead to diarrhea nausea and vomiting blood blood system blood contains various cells that supply oxygen and vital nutrients to the body multiple organ dysfunction syndrome 
can involve internal or external bleeding causes multiple organ dysfunction syndrome can have a wide range of causes as it develops from damage to any organs many diseases infections or injuries could affect organs and potentially lead to multiple organ dysfunction syndrome which occurs as a process rather than a single event for example a possible cause is disseminated intravascular coagulation a condition that causes excessive blood clots and bleeding the condition can damage organs and may lead to multiple organ dysfunction syndrome certain incidents can also trigger multiple organ dysfunction syndrome for example septic shock is a common trigger of multiple organ dysfunction syndrome this is a severe incident her blood pressure drops dangerously low and can cause death treatment treatment for multiple organ dysfunction syndrome will depend on which organs are failing and their severity however multiple organ dysfunction syndrome requires emergency care treatment there is currently no specific treatment to cure multiple organ dysfunction syndrome and treatment is highly complex given the involvement of multiple failing organs some organs may respond to treatment better than others and recovery can be a slow process doctors may use extra corporeal organ support which involves removing blood from failing organs and applying specific treatments or devices before recirculating the blood the cause of multiple organ dysfunction syndrome may also require direct treatment for example sepsis is a possible cause of multiple organ dysfunction syndrome and involves the body overreacting to an infection treatments could involve antibiotics intravenous fluids and surgery